Livestock Vaccines El Marmolio. You know the importance of early marbling in your cattle herd. Marbling in meat is a topic of great interest in livestock farming, since it is one of the characteristics by which you can win the palate and heart of diners or consumers. In this video we will talk about the importance that has the marbling from an early age in your herd. Something that must be taken into account and with great responsibility that early marbling starts from the farm where the cattle herd is located, which is why cattle producers are advised to analyze the importance of the processes, which have a direct impact on this factor. The energy that is stored in the body of cattle, the greatest amount is stored in the form of fat and can be in the internal organs, inside the muscles, just below the intramuscular fat or skin, which is generally he calls it marbling. This fat that is mentioned is what gives consumers a pleasant experience when eating it when this meat is well marbled, and even better if the fat comes from a grass-based diet. If this fat originates from grass-based diets, this fat will be very rich in the fatty acid called omega-3, which will undoubtedly help people or consumers to be healthier. Another great importance of this fat is that it is available to bovines in times of scarcity of food supply, or if the bovine is sick, in other words, this intramuscular fat is easily assimilated and available in these times. We must take into account that marbling is the intramuscular fat that is deposited in the bovine after compliance with the lactation and maintenance requirements, which is why bovines specialized in meat production take some time to obtain it. The fatty acids called omega-3 come from milk or beef from cattle that are fed on grass this fat is also present in seaweed, sea fish. It is worth noting that this fat is needed by the human organism for a better well-being. Linoleic acid also comes into play since it is present in beef and milk, which is present in grass-fed cattle. Something to note is that when cattle are grain-fed, it is for this reason that the consumer should preferably consume milk and meat from cattle, which were fed on pastures. For the producer this is a great advantage, since it is cheaper to produce grass-fed meat, and for the consumer a healthier food is produced, at the same time the land regenerates. Another great aspect is that to achieve this objective, you must have bovines that marble at an early age, and for this we must select bovines not by price, rather the selection should be oriented by genetic quality. Cattle that present early marbling have fat or stored energy, in order to have it available when required. Marbling is also directly related to early sexual maturity, which is why if the selection is based on this aspect, it will be selecting bovines of greater productivity by hectare. Sexual maturity and early marbling in bovines always go hand in hand. Modern bovine selection, in order to achieve higher feed conversions, has not taken these two aspects into account, and the tests and methods to find the bovines of greater efficiency lead genetics to produce meat with less marbling and leaner, and this phenomenon occurs because fat requires much more energy than lean meat to form it. More energy is also released when the bovine is sick or it faces a shortage of food, which is why a fat cattle with intramuscular fat will be able to survive with less care than a lean one.